how many times are you laying in bed very sad or very depressed and you just want consolation from your pet so you spill your deepest darkest most horrendous secrets to it well i have scary news for you we are listening and we can talk now i've been living with my family for about six years now and let me tell you the gossip that they tell me expecting me not to say anything ooh, get them all in trouble now let's start with dad dad just broke mom's favorite face and he has it hidden in the garage once i go in there when they let me out every day i've been trying to nudge my way to point out to her but he always closes the door before i can he's praying that she doesn't actually notice it because then he's going to get in trouble and he's going to be in the doghouse. Now, mom, mom's been sneaking out and uh, she's been eating ice cream in the kitchen while I'm in my crate, even though she's saying she's on a diet. Yeah, a diet of ice cream at one in the morning. Not even I can call that a diet. Now, the little one, she's five. Ooh, she has been shoving her toys underneath the couch and then crying about not being able to find them so that her older brothers give her attention. What are you going to do about it? Aunt Janice, oh, she's the middle kid. She just got a piercing. And if she's not telling mom or dad yet, and she's going to get it handed to her when she does. Now the older boys, they've been drinking in their room. You can see it, smell the stench in their room. And they tell me all the time, they're like, ha ha ha, mom and dad will never find out. Well. What if I just went up to mom and dad and told them? Who would know? But I keep all those secrets to myself. Plus, I got better things to do. I smell the bell, man. I'm gonna go chase him. 